killer? No. I ever call myself a killer? Ever advertise, analyze myself as a killer? No. Then you should be careful how you categorize people. Well, I Shut the fuck up! Because by whacking a guy, you're making a decision. You're deciding to check him out of the hotel a little early. It's an irrevocable, irreplaceable, irreversible decision. These aren't decisions. These are punishments. Well, how do you condone punishments? I just said hypothetically, if someone did condone it, they might argue that certain men have a moral obligation to keep other ass fucks on the level. For example, it might be my moral duty to potty train this pile of pussy rejecting fuck heap. But my own private idol. <laughs> what is your disease, man? Huh? Why do you keep blapping that shit off? Oh, what do you mean? Just answer the question. You mean answer movies? the fucking question. Well, You're not right? asking another question, answer well, me. What do you mean? God! Damn! I'm a writer. A writer? Yeah, I write movies. Prove it. I can't prove it. You're alive. I'm not alive. What do you got? I don't know. I thought about it a lot. So what are these movies you think about a lot about? I don't know. Different stuff. <laughs> are they like funny? Ha, 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 ha. No, not really. Tits and ass, jerk off real fast, that kind of stuff? No. Cops and robbers, good guys, bad guys kind of stuff? No. Shit. You probably have your own technique and everything. That's cool. So it's not like this or that, not one specific identifiable thing that in like five or ten years some other guy will be writing something and some guy will ask him what he's writing about and he'll be like, it's like, what are those, uh, what's your name? Joey? It's like one of those Joey... last name? Drake? It's like one of those Joey Drake movies. That's how I'll classify it. Not a comedy, not cops and robbers, not tits and ass. Joey Drake. Own little category. That's cool. Yeah, I guess so. So is your stuff good? I don't know. How can you not know? I never told anybody about it. What does that mean? I don't like criticism. <laughs> That's a pussy attitude. Yeah. <laughs> Big hairy poom tang attitude. That's what I mean. I mean, I got these movies, these ideas. And I, well, come and on, hey. We're all friends here, right? Yeah, I know. Sharing's caring. <coughs> well, it's like that one story. The tortured painter guy. Have you ever heard it? No. I'll share it with you. Hey. about this guy, and he's this painter, and he's really good, and he might be really good, he might be really, really good, but he doesn't know. So sometimes he'll take his paintings to this businessman guy, and he'll show them to him, and the businessman guy will be like, well, that's a pretty good painting, but that's already been done before. So the painter guy gets mad, because he thinks he's being a copycat, and who wants to be a copycat? Fucking no one. Yeah. So he goes home and he cries, and he starts another painting. This time around, though, he doesn't want to be a copycat. Fuck that. Yeah, so he decides to paint something new. Something that's never been done before. What's he paint? Well, it doesn't matter. It's just something new, you know? And it's a masterpiece. So he, he takes it to that same businessman guy from the day before and shows it to him. And the businessman guy says, what the heck is that? That's a pile of crap. You can't paint that. People never paint that. And the painter guy says, well, why can't I be the first one to paint that? I mean, after all, Somebody had to be the first one to paint it. And the businessman guy, he just laughs and shakes his head. And he says, in art, there are rules, like in life. And you would be best suited to follow these rules and not get hurt. These rules are created for the benefit of everyone, so that no one gets hurt. And that painting is a pile of crap. And nobody wants a pile of crap. You kick his fucking ass? No. He went home and started another painting. He's the tortured painter guy. <laughs> he'll paint something that's already been done and he'll never be famous. Or he'll try something new and everybody will laugh at him. And he'll start over. Hmm. Over and over and over. The devil's game. That endless loop. <laughs> it's a great story. Yeah? Goddamn great story. I've heard that before. 
<laughs> you haven't heard that before? Yeah, I've heard that before. That's cool. No, I didn't copy that. Not that exact same thing, just something similar, you know? Same idea about the guy who's destined to play God. Well, I've never heard it. You've never heard it? It's a real brutal kind of... Yeah? You've never heard it? Never heard it. 